Sunlight sifts through the canopy, then breaks into motes over a cluster of orchids. A whisper of motion crosses the flowers, but the visitor is mostly air, a body with edges and panes that pass the forest behind straight through. Petals tremble, a shadow refracts and is gone. Only when the angle is right do panels flash, then turn to glass again. This is flight with almost no outline, where transparent butterfly wings turn brightness into cover. In a place of constant pursuit, the effect reads like transparent armor of the rainforest, a moving gap in the picture that predators try to track and lose. Cloud forest gives way to lowland glades. Scent plumes rise from verbena and aster blooms. Nectar draws a circuit of day-active insects that must feed in the open and survive the attention it invites. Here, a small deliberate flyer threads the dim gaps and sun shafts, often in pairs, riding slow figure eights around preferred flowers and shaded resting leaves. When disturbed, it slides sideways rather than bolts, as if trusting in visibility more than speed. Eggs appear on host leaves under broad, protective veils. Larvae feed in arches, pupae hang like polished leaves. Only after watching the rhythm does the name fit the ghost you keep failing to follow. The glasswing, a clear-wing butterfly, whose panels seem to be missing. Glasswing butterfly. Wings. The transparent armor of the rainforest is not metaphor. It is engineering worn like a cloak. Here is the puzzle, stated exactly. How do microscopic wing structures create transparency while maintaining strength and durability? Wings must bear load, flex against turbulence, repel rain, and endure months of use. Yet these panes transmit most light and across many viewing angles. High reflectance would betray the trick with bright glare, but the surface stays quiescent, even under harsh sun. Microscopy reveals sparse, shrunken scales around windows, framed by darker borders. Above the membranes rise irregular nanopillars, tiny waxy projections, hundreds of nanometers tall, that grade the refractive index from air to cuticle, dampening reflections over a sweep of wavelengths and angles. Beneath, a thin chitin film spans between veins, shaped as stiffeners and shock absorbers. The result is a pane that bends light to vanish, then bends mechanically without tearing. The paradox deepens in rain, Droplets should dot the surface with lenses that flash like beacons. Instead, they bead and roll in silence, leaving the sheet clear. The whole system turns optics and mechanics into one answer. Three lines of explanation lead. First, anti-reflective chaos. Rather than perfect rows, the nanopillars scatter in size and spacing, which evidence suggests breaks the angle dependence that would otherwise betray the flyer with glare. This disordered field reduces Fresnel reflections across the spectrum, a broadband solution to remaining unseen. Core to glasswing butterfly camouflage and glasswing predator avoidance alike. The trade-off is fragility. Waxy nano forests can abrade. Yet rain cleans without erasing them, and new wear forms still scatter light enough to keep windows dull. Second, composite toughness. Transparency is not emptiness. It is a laminate. The membrane's nanofibers run with veins to share load, while pigmented borders and cross veins act as frames, resisting crack propagation when a thorn nicks the edge. Studies indicate slight corrugation in the clear zones stiffens them against buckling, a rainforest insect adaptation that lets large panes stay thin. 
The cost is that extreme bends can whiten the film as fibers align and scatter light. Damaged panels show hazy scars that reduce the vanish effect until the next molt. Never for an adult. Third, hydrophobic self-preservation. Those same nanopillars shed water and grime, preventing micro droplets from forming the bright specular points that would defeat invisible flight. The surface keeps a high contact angle, so rain skitters off, and with it, spores and dust that would raise scatter. The limit appears in sticky pollen clouds or oil. Fouling can dull transparency until grooming or wear restores it. Scientists still debate how much chemistry versus texture sets this balance, and nobody knows why some populations show denser pillars than others under similar climates. Variation may ride humidity, plant chemistry, or ancestry. Behavior stitches physics to survival. The flyer chooses backgrounds that keep borders and body aligned with stems, so only the muted brown frames register, while windows feed the forest through. When it lands, it holds the wings at angles that erase glare, then rocks minutely to match leaf flicker. Glasswing predator avoidance is not only materials, it is choreography. During courtship, evidence suggests males sequester plant alkaloids and broadcast pheromone, selling both transparency and distaste in one package. When a bird finally attempts a strike, the clear panes reduce motion cues, the attacker tracks contrast and comes up short, the ghost already slid aside. Here, transparent butterfly wings and slow lateral dodges merge into one message. You cannot grab what you cannot resolve. The system's elegance has been rewriting what we thought we knew about how delicate films can be, both optical devices and load-bearing structures. It also has edges. In fog, stray light from droplets can paint the windows. Under harsh backlight, even perfect anti-reflectors whisper a sheen. Predators adapt. Some learn to lunge at the body and ignore the missing panels. Even so, glasswing butterfly camouflage keeps the ledger in the black often enough to pass genes forward. A breeze lifts and the ghost returns to the flowers. Borders wink, then dim. Panes show only what lies behind. Can invisibility see as simple as bending light? The answer folds to a tighter truth. Not simple, but layered. Nano pillars, membranes, frames and choices in motion, all tuned to rain and sun. Glasswing butterfly wings. The transparent armor of the rainforest endures while leaves shine and predators hunt by outline. If the forest brightens or aerosols glaze the air, the trick may dull. For now, the clear wing butterfly remains a moving absence that leaves the eye chasing an image already vanished, an untraceable traveler whose beauty is the space it does not occupy.